वॉट आर दी प्रॉब्लम इन इन्फेंट रिलेटेड टू ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग इन इन्फेंट्स हु आर एक्सक्लूसिवली ब्रेस्ट फेड द मेजर प्रॉब्लम विच इज आस्ट इन एंट्रेंस एग्जाम इज इंक्रीज रिस्क ऑफ न्योनेटल जॉन्डिस यू नो दैट ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग दिस जॉन्डिस विच इज सीन एंड रिलेटेड टू ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग कैन बी कैटेगराइज इन टू टू पार्ट्स इट कैन बी आई दर अ ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग जॉन्डिस और इट कैन बी अ ब्रेस्ट मिल्क जॉन्डिस ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग जॉन्डिस इज फाउंड टू बी रिलेटिवली कॉमन वेर एज ब्रेस्ट मिल्क जॉन्डिस इज फाउंड टू बी रेयर वॉट इज द रीजन फॉर ब्रेस्ट फीडिंग जॉन्डिस इट अकर्स ड्यू टू डिक्रीज्ड फीडिंग ऑफ द बेबी दिस डिक्रीज फीडिंग प्रोड्यूसिज रिलेटिव डिहाइड्रेशन एंड इनडायरेक्टली इंक्रीजेज एंटेरो हिपेटिक सर्कुलेशन ऑफ अनकॉन्जुगेटेड बिलिरोबिन which results in slightly increased levels of unconjugated bilirubin what is the treatment of breastfeeding jaundice you increase the feeds and the patient will be fine breast milk jaundice occurs due to substances in the breast milk which either decrease conjugation or they have glucuronidase action details of these are there in your neonatology segment glucuronidase action means the conjugated bilirubin will be back converted by glucuronides into unconjugated bilirubin and so they can cause significantly high levels so i'm using three errors of unconjugated bilirubin and can even if not properly managed they can even cause connectors in the patient so and cephalopathy can happen treatment now earlier the concept was you stop breast feeding for a few days and then uh, restart it slowly but uh, aims protocol pgi blue book as well as all the standard books say that there is need to stop breast feeding you continue breast feeding in the baby and you give aggressive phototherapy and exchange transfusion it is found that after the first 4 weeks of life are gone slowly that the breast milk jaundice the ability of substances in the milk to produce such phenomena they tend to come down and so the child automatically improves so during that transition period when this problem is happening you need to aggressively manage phototherapy using phototherapy using exchange transfusion till the time the child comes out of it but we continue breastfeeding in all scenarios so this is these are the problems in infant related to breastfeeding other than that breastfeeding is always beneficial to the baby